I hope everybody knows about this cartoon. Doraemon is a Japanese anime series. The series follows the adventures of a robotic cat named Doraemon, helping a young boy Nobita to overcome his daily struggles with its tools and gadgets. It also assists Nobita in doing homeworks and studies. In the same way, in real world, we got the virtual AI tool called ChatGPT. With ChatGPT, you get the personalized assistant like Doraemon to help you prepare for any competitive exams like NEET. ChatGPT can answer any questions you have about the topic you need to study. In this video, I have explained three strategies to use ChatGPT as your Doraemon to make your NEET preparation much efficient. I also given bonus tip in some part of this video that will boost your preparation 10 times faster. To know that, stick to this video till the end. If you are new to my channel, hello, I am Ibrahim, final year MBBA student from Chennai. Okay, let's not delay any further. Moving on to strategy number 1. The Feynman Technique is a study technique named after the famous physicist Richard Feynman, who was known for his ability to explain in simple terms. This technique involves 4 steps. Step number 1. Choose the concept you want to study. Step number 2. Explain the concept in simple terms as you are teaching it to your small kid. Step number 3. If you struggle, go back to the source and review the areas that you are unclear. Step number 4. Repeat the steps until you can explain the concepts clearly. I feel this as a powerful technique to study concepts particularly for physics. Now I will show you how to implement this technique using chat GPT. Let us assume we are going to learn about our inertia. What many students will try to do is they just open chat GPT and then they type explain about inertia then enter. Now chat GPT explains about inertia. Now they just read the same text as given in the book. If you follow this then there is no difference between reading a textbook and using chat GPT. Now I will tell you what you need to do actually. Open chat GPT and type inertia and after that type explain this topic to a small kid. Now chat GPT generate response in simple terms in which even a small kid can understand. By following this strategy you can understand any difficult concepts in physics. The great scientist Albert Einstein says if you can't explain it to your 6 year old then you don't understand it yourself. So understand how important this strategy is and implement this technique in your study routine and you will notice a massive improvement in understanding the concepts. Moving on to strategy number 2. Active learning is a process in which the student take an active role in their own learning rather than just passively receiving information. I even stressed about this technique in many of my videos because it is important and this is how our brain learns and remembers information for a very long time. By using chat GPT as a tool for active learning, you can practice critical thinking problem solving skills. I will show you how to use chat GPT for active learning. Step number 1. Select the topic that you wish to revise. Step number 2. Now just copy all the content and paste it here and under this paragraph type generate mcqs for the above para. After that now it will ask questions from the above para. Now if you don't know any answer for these questions just type the question number it will display the answer with explanation. Not only mcqs you can generate any type of questions and as many questions you need. Now you don't need any question bank or any app subscription to solve questions. Just ask chat gpt then you are ready to go. Before moving on to next part I would like to give you a bonus tip. Flashcards are useful tool for learning and retaining information. They contain questions on one side and answers or solution on the other side. These promote active learning. They can be made easily and can be used anytime anywhere. The good news is you can make flashcards with chat gpt just enter the paragraph you wish to make a flashcard then type create a flashcard with rows and columns there you go you will get a beautiful flashcard you can just copy and paste it to your digital flashcard app like anki or remnote if you need a special tutorial on how to use anki just comment below now moving on to strategy number three Another interesting thing that I found from ChatGPT is the ability to make a personalized timetable. Hey ChatGPT, I have my need exam on May 7. Can you make me a study timetable? Enter. 
Oh, it got an answer. Unbelievable. It makes rows and columns for a week. Wow. It makes me a timetable for a week from morning 6 a.m. till 9 p.m. It also allocates time to solve previous year questions, which is very very important. And at the bottom it mentions this is just an example you can personalize according to your personal preferences this is amazing but wait a minute it can also make study timetable for a specific topics if you mention it by using chat gpt you can create the study timetable you need and you can customize according to your preferences these are the three most powerful study strategy i found that will make your preparation much better if you are watching my video for the first time make sure you subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever i make a new video thank you for watching my video till the end see you in my next video